speak to the camera. And uh, three, two, one. Okay. High fructose corn syrup in the United States is genetically engineered. Now, it's so processed, there's no more DNA or protein. So some people that don't understand the process of genetic engineering assume that because it doesn't contain DNA or protein, it's safe as normal corn. But the process of genetic engineering causes massive collateral damage in the DNA. So there's an allergen that's now switched on in Monsanto's corn. It's not found in natural corn. There's an endocrine disruptor that was found. It was, turns out that it's in different concentrations in GM corn compared to non-GM corn, and it doesn't just get destroyed in very high temperatures. So the author of that study suggested that it's found even in corn oil. We've never tested to see if that endocrine disruptor is in the high fructose corn syrup, but it's just one of many possible changes in the composition of the corn that could end up in the corn syrup, making the GM corn syrup different than the non-GM corn syrup. So that's why even if something is highly processed and has no DNA or no protein, it still might be dangerous or more dangerous if it's genetically engineered.